Three men all punched by a stranger within a week. And tonight, police tell us they believe the same man is behind all of the attacks in the village. And new tonight, CBS 2's Alicia Reed spoke with the most recent victim who was left with serious injuries to his face. A Saturday afternoon run to the neighborhood grocery store landed this man in the hospital. Within a minute of walking outside his 9th Street building. I don't know if he pulled my shoulder or my arm, but I got spun around. And when I, when I spun, there was already a fist right here. And that shot was the hardest, I think. That's what broke, I think, the orbital bones. The victim didn't want to show his face as his attacker remains on the loose. In addition to facial fractures, he has stitches on his lip. Four on the outside and two inside the... He hit you really hard. Yeah, he's a good hitter, if nothing else. Police are looking for this individual. Historically, a very quiet, peaceful neighborhood. Everybody's pretty rattled. He's wanted in connection to two other assaults in the 6th Precinct. One on January 3rd near Bedford in Grove and on January 4th on 5th Avenue and East 11th Street. Detectives say it's the same M.O. The suspect didn't rob his victims, just brutally attacked them and took off. I hope it doesn't take another victim to find the guy. Felony assaults are up in the 6th Precinct. Five so far this year compared to three in the same time period last year. Misdemeanor assaults are also up. 14 so far this year compared to three in January 2022. What if it was my wife? You know, what if it was one of my kids? Like that's the more of the concern. The victim says his injuries will take about six weeks to heal. As for his right eye, he tells me doctors will continue to monitor and hopefully there will be no need for surgery. In Greenwich Village, Elisa Reed, CBS 2 News.